On Friday, Tolco and the Forest Enhancement Society gave a tour of some of the fire mitigation work they've been performing in the Joe Rich area. The provincially funded organization, which works to remove fire fuels from crown land forested areas, has been in operation since 2016. We've been an active uh, participant in funding proponent-based grants um, for our, our five purposes. So reducing the risk of wildfire is one of them, improving low value or damaged forests, improving wildlife habitat, recovering fiber, and reducing greenhouse gases. So far, more than 180 projects are underway across the province, several of which are in the Okanagan. At the Joe Rich site, Tolco is the company doing the work on the ground for the Forest Enhancement Society. We worked with a fire expert to help uh, design which ones were, you know, we had mapping that showed us where the homes were. We kind of tied the hand treatments to adjacent to people's houses. And then um, through our planning group, we've kind of built the, the broader plan, which involves the harvesting and things like that. Uh, this treatment gets the fire onto the ground where the hand crews can deal with it. It's not in the trees. It's it's a uh, much safer environment for them to work, and it gives them uh, the ability to get out as well. After the large fire that tore through the community in the summer of 2017, Joe Rich residents are keen on the fire mitigation work. Overall, the residents really feel that this is uh, an important part of, you know, the Joe Rich uh, forest, you know, to keep it healthy and safe and, and have a good collaborative voice with the people who are, you know, looking after this project, which is TOCO and, of course, FES BC. For Castanet News here in the Joe Rich area of Kelowna, I'm Nick Johansson.